Some Bedford County parents are upset with comments allegedly made to their students by the superintendent. Yeah, parents say the comments were made during conversations about the district's new cell phone policy. As ABC 13's Brittany Slaughter explains, these parents and students say the topics made them feel uncomfortable. Bedford County Schools announced last week it will be adopting the governor's cell phone policy effective January 1st. The policy says students will not be allowed to use their cell phones bell to bell. But it's what was allegedly said by Superintendent William DePair during meetings with students that's raising concerns. Savannah Hardy is a member of the National Honor Society at Stanton River High School. During one meeting, she says the superintendent tied cell phones to pornography and addiction. I don't know how getting rid of cell phones in the classroom will equal to a decrease in porn. It made no sense. Again, a lot of what he said made no sense. Um, but it just it felt very inappropriate. Liberty High School sophomore class president Zach Martin says the superintendent brought up cell phones in suicide. Did not address the men in the room. He said men don't struggle with mental health and that that's not an issue for men. Little girls get, little girls get, um, get in their heads because of body dysmorphia because of their phones. Parent Alicia Williams tells me Superintendent Dupier stopped at her daughter's lunch table to discuss the connection between cell phones and pornography. The conversation made her daughter feel uncomfortable. I would tell my daughter to stay as far away from this man as she possibly could and to not trust him and to make sure that she never finds herself alone with him. Don't push your troubles on my children. Um, if my children were having problems with any of those things, if they were having issues with, with social media, if they were having issues with pornography, if they were having issues with bullying or anything like that, that can happen as a result of cell phone use. We would take the phones away as a parent. I reached out to the school district several times since last week, asking for an interview or a statement from Superintendent Dupier. The district declined. At the tone, please record your message. When you've finished recording, you may hang up or press one for more options. Hey there, this is Brittany with ABC 13. I also reached out to all the school board members and only heard back from three. One said no comment, another said he believes the rumors are unfounded, and a third, Jonathan Knight, tells me he was just hearing of the allegations and plans to look into it. Now, I've been communicating with two other parents who tell me their children also have concerns with the topics discussed at these meetings, but they declined to go on camera. There was supposed to be an informational meeting tonight at Liberty High School to discuss the new phone policy, but that was pushed back to November. It's unclear why. Back to you.